In general, a classical system of n bits can only ever be in just one of two to the n possible combinations of zeros and ones. A quantum system of n qubits can be in a superposition of all two to the n of these states. The scaling is exponential. So even if we had just 10 qubits, they could be in a superposition state of two to the 10, which is 1,024 possible combinations of zeros and ones. The exponential scaling of the state space of qubits is called quantum parallelism and is partially responsible for the advantage of quantum computers over classical computers. But a quantum computer is not just a massive parallel processor. Just because the qubits in a quantum computer can be in a superposition of exponentially many states, doesn't mean we have access to all the information in each of these states, since measurement collapses the system into one state or another.